So originally, this was going to be the V Shoujo video, an Insana graduate, and after drowning my sorrow in alcohol for a while, I figured I was finally emotionally ready to record. So let's start with our favourite big anime girl. So Sana's unfortunately graduating, but I think these graduation streams have kind of shown just what was so amazing about her. Despite these streams supposedly being sad, Sana still manages to make them incredibly fun and heartwarming. I, I brought some cookies for this stream. That's the thing about Sana, she's always smiling, happy, and brightening up the room like the sun. Okay look, I had to fit a space pun in here somewhere and the Jupiter thing was a bit too obvious, alright? It's sad to see her go, but I'd put money on her going on to do something even more amazing. I love you all. You're all loved by the universe. The great thing about Crony is that you never have to worry about simping too much for her, because you could never love Crony more than Crony loves Crony. Do you have a, uh, like a husband or a waifu when it comes to anime? Let me just uh, yes. Oh yes. Crony. <laughs> At this point, I'm pretty sure her house is just a hall of mirrors, because she's 100% the type of person that would unironically put a photo of themselves as their phone wallpaper. Compared to other VTubers, Crony does her absolute best to put up with none of chat's usual shit, presenting this outward persona that's calm and collected and promptly breaks down the moment anything remotely scary happens. Not gonna lie though, watching Crony mentally break may be one of the most entertaining pastimes known to man. <laughs> Mumi is... uh... I forgot, okay, I was just going to pretend to forget everything here, but really that would be doing a disservice to the rest of Mumi, including the horror movie she calls a train of thought. Oh, well, I'm, I'm going to make sure you, you, all, I'm going to, I'm going to make sure you, 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 I, I'm going to do it. <laughs> yeah, well, debut Mumi was a forgetful, scatterbrained, adorable owl. Current Mumi is, well, still that, let's be honest, look at her. Oh, hi. But occasionally we get a glimpse of this Mumi. Ta da! Look, I'm not saying that Mumi is a host body puppeted by an eldritch being, I'm just saying I don't think this shit could be drawn by a sane person, okay? Please don't eat me. We've established before that every VTuber generation needs a parental figure to prevent the entire generation from destroying the world. Fauna is the calming, doting maternal figure Freud says you have a thing for. She's got a soothing voice, personality, and may bury you in her back garden so you never leave, but let's be real, you degenerates would probably be into that. We can never leave, that's right, because we're saplings, buried in the forest. Even if you wanted to leave, you wouldn't be able to. It's pretty hard to really be scared of this yandery part of her when you've also heard her speak like this. So I was you. definitely not my woman I only have... So Bay is apparently the embodiment of chaos, but oh, hold on, wait a second, my tea is ready. Mm. So, as I was saying, Bay is meant to be the embodiment of chaos, but with beings like Hachima running around, she more gives off angry little cousin vibes. Like, yeah, don't leave her alone with the stove, or open sockets, or alcohol. God, don't leave her alone with alcohol. I suck. I can't believe I can't. I'm gonna take a sip. Let's take a sip, Bay. Cheers! But she probably won't destroy the natural order of the world. She may decide to get married, and then divorced, and then married again, and you know what, this relationship should really only be touched by a licensed psychiatrist, so I'm not going anywhere near it. I, wait, I haven't grown into a beautiful lady. No, 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 oh, no, 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 oh, you, no, 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 huh? no, 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 you're just, no. you're just so tiny. So yeah, Iris isn't technically a council member, so we'll leave her for another date. No, hang on lads, give me a sec. Okay, so after doing a bit of thinking, I've decided that excluding Iris would be bad for my physical and mental well-being, so here we go. So, Iris. Iris. It's Iris. Wait, that's Bay again. So, Iris. Iris. It's Iris. Nope, hang on. So, Iris. Half angel, half devil, all your virus. The other half of this relationship, if you can call it that. She's kind of the middle child of Hall IVN, and to be fair, she does radiate middle child energy. Desiring affection from other family members, overly interested in Monopoly for some reason, most likely to become a supervillain. Wazab! He buys private ah! shirt. Wazab! <laughs> Wazab! Oh yeah, you heard me. You thought hope has descended was an inspiring statement? Nah, that shit's a threat. 
I mean, with the half and half theme, the talk of hope and despair, and the tendency towards absurd amounts of violence, she's basically the waifu version of Monokuma. Okay, V Shoujo next, probably. Gonna have to watch a ton of their clips, which will probably put me on a list somewhere, so wish me luck.